About a month since this massive fire in downtown Franklin destroyed a shop on Main Street, it was investigated as an electrical fire. But more problems continue to plague the building, and now police are involved. 13 News Now reporter Chinu Hur joins us to explain. Well, that's right, David. Recently, police say thieves were stripping the building of copper, hitting the two AC units nearby. Shops didn't really want to talk about the fire or the copper thieves, but one owner did mention this has happened in town before. It was a day people in Franklin still think about. A fire so massive, Main Street was shut down. With it, a piece of history burned down. It's just always been there. And now, you know, for a while it was just rubble and smoke. And now it's gone. That building has always been a part of James Carr's childhood, being born and raised in Franklin. His neighbors around town felt the same. Well, it was a genuine drugstore. It was a dime store at one time. It just was a very hot fire. I was sorry to see it go. Don't I chop that when I was a little boy. As they come to grips with losing that, they're also dealing with thieves who have targeted the building after the fire. Well, they stole all the copper out of there. They did. Sure did. James, as much as he loves his hometown, says he's seen this problem in Franklin before. People looking to make a few dollars from scrap metal. Just, just another day in front, you know. There's other people around here everywhere that uh, they're looking for a fast buck. Franklin police says thieves stripped the copper from two AC units after the fire, and now they're investigating. Hurtful to see old memories gone and thieves picking apart what's left. It's terrible. I hate it. But there's nothing we can do about it, you know. Now, as far as the fire investigation goes, I did reach out to the Franklin Fire Rescue to see if there were any updates as to what caused it. I haven't heard back, but we'll keep you updated if we do. Chew her, 13 News Now.